Hey, guess what? I've got a job that you're going to love. Nice and easy. This is strictly a salvage mission. No crazy shit, I promise. One of those old pre-FTL generation ships from the 2000s. The Mugungwa. However the hell you pronounce that. Just popped up my radar. Its disappearance was apparently some big unsolved mystery? Never made it to the destination, I guess. It's just drifting lifelessly in orbit of Antares B. I'll send you the exact coordinates. It's pretty hard to get a visual on. Probably why nobody's found it before. The sponsor for this one is a historical society from the Outer Colonies. Here's what the objective card says. Download any log files you can, especially any that can explain what happened to the ship. If possible, speak to the security AI mute for assistance. It's a good, easy gig, and I want you to take this one. It should be a social. It should be a social enough for you. I don't want to hear any complaints. Dispatch control out. Hello, everyone. This is Jane Steiner. Welcome to Analog, a hate story. So, this is another visual novel, seeing as I already finished Shangui. So let's just do this one. It should be interesting. I've read the synopsis. It looks like it's going to be very, very fascinating. So let's just jump right into it. I'm only going to do it for about 10 minutes or so. It should be enough to digest. Notice, this system is property of the Unified Korea Space Probe Agency. Access by individuals not affiliated with the UKSPA or a successor organization is a felony under the UKSPA Act of 2381. Last login user, Kim Hyun A. 2-2-1-4-3-2 days ago. Error, AI personality currently disabled, referring to command line, available commands, download, disable AI, enable AI, help, sue, and quit. Oh, I have to actually type it in. Enable AI. AI, enable AI personality. Use to select a new AI personality. Any active personality must be disabled first. Currently available personalities. Hume A. Okay, let's do Hume A. Did not misspell it. Try help for command list. Okay, let's just try Hume a. Okay. Download. Oop, I, I just spelled it. Download. Admin access required. Please use sue first. Sue. Surprise to administer access required password to use. Okay. Help. Enable AI help sue and quit. Disable underscore AI. I, it didn't do the S. Disable AI. No person I uh, currently enabled. Okay, so let's enable underscore AI. Uh, any active personality disables are currently available personalities. Oh, enable underscore AI Hune dash A. Is now activated. You may now close this terminal with quit. Quit. Okay, that's actually very interesting. Oh. Hello? Oh. oh my word! An external connection? Is someone out there? It's been so many years since I've spoken to anyone. Oh jeez, I'm being discourteous. My apologies, please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Hyun A. The star is, of course, silent. It just represents that I'm an AI. <laughs> I control all the log keeping systems on the Mugungwa. Or at least, what's left of them. Please, just excuse me for one second. I'll give you a terminal so you can respond. There you are. Go ahead and introduce yourself. 
I am James Steiner. Ah, oh, jeez, my apologies. I don't know why, but what you typed just looked like garbage to me. That's bad. I think there may be a problem with my language parsing systems. Ah! Sorry, somehow your input is getting mangled between the terminal and me. I'm so terribly sorry. Let me just try something. Can you understand this? Yes. All right. Very well, we have that, at least. I'm afraid if we can't get text input fixed, that'll have to suffice. I'm terribly sorry. It must be difficult being unable to say anything. Yeah, it actually is. This might be difficult then. Well, nevertheless, as the archive system AI, I'll do my best to try to help you navigate these records anyway. Unfortunately, it might be a little difficult since, well, without language parsing, you won't be able to text searches either. You won't be able to do text searches either. Don't worry though, it's my duty to provide assistance with archive functions. I'll do my best. Right, let me see. I'll try to provide you with a sampling of logs to start out with, and you can just show me things you want more information on. I, uh, hope that'll be acceptable to you. That's all I can do. Well, that's all, I suppose. Pardon me, let me just build you an interface to work with so you don't have to struggle with a terminal. Very well, it's all set. And, um, I suppose this is a little bit awkward, but, uh, can I just say one more thing before you get to work? Sure, why not? I'm just very happy to be working with you. I've had nobody to talk to for such a long time. It's got so... it got so lonely. Having someone to talk to is just really, really amazing. I thought maybe I never would again. Sorry about the communication barrier, but even still... She is acting very human. I'm some tells you that this AI isn't what it seems. Ah, oh, jeez, I'm babbling. I won't hold you up any longer. Here's your interface. I hope it's good enough. Oh, this is going to be a very, very interesting one. It's already been a few minutes. Uh, so let's take a look-see here. Uh, no, messages have been read. Uh, let's speak with her a little bit first. If you look in your interface, once you open a document, you can click on that little button of me to show me whatever it is. So which subject do you wish to know more about? Alright, let's access the log documents. Let's take a look-see here. Type the document ID and press enter. Okay, we've got the blo- Okay, uh, let's do block four. Let's see what's in here. A pack of idiots. Smith Kyung Sam. When our family falls into decline, I just want to be perfectly clear why. It's because Dai Hyun's sons are the biggest collection of idiots on the entire ship. Ooh. Father says these sorts of words shouldn't be written down, calling them unfilial. But I'm skeptical. I intend no disrespect to my noble ancestors, but my dead uncle is no ancestor of mine, and his family deserves no respect. Ooh, that's kind of harsh. Uh, this has been in motion for years now. It was an inevitability, even that any sons of Dai Hume would turn out the way they did. But up until now, to anyone outside of the family, it's been well hidden. Only now is it starting to fall apart in a way that no amount of good politics can disguise. The turning point was this year. At the time I write this, I am returning from Sang Jung's funeral. In that family, there were three brothers. Sang Jung, the drunk, Sang Kyu, the dim-witted brute, and Sang Min, who, despite being the eldest, seems to have more interest in cavorting with courtesans than creating an heir. Ooh. That's usually a very big thing, the whole heir thing, especially with um, most Asian-based cultures. Anything from the Far East, whether it be Japanese, Chinese, Korean, Vietnamese, there's always this big emphasis on you having an heir, and it's usually a male heir. So the fact that I think that this is a Korean ship based on what was said in the introduction. So yeah, that would actually be very important, but they seem very uninterested in continuing that. So let's just continue. Noticeably absent from the morning proceeding was Sung Kyu. 
What he was doing, I don't know. Knowing him, I can only guess. The affair was made even more laughable by Sang Min and his widowed mother's ins insistence that Sang Jung had died of natural causes. Apparently, they had even found a doctor willing to put such nonsense on the official record. Oh, so he... Oh. An unmarried noble managing to drink his way into the grave at only 30 years of age would be embarrassing enough. To brazenly try to hide the obvious, however... That will mark the beginning of the Smith family's fall. Oh dear God. Oh, um, hello. Yeah. Uh, actually, I was just testing that indicator I can see if it'd get your attention. I just thought uh, it'd be a good way of letting you know when I have something to say. I mean, like, if I think it's super important, I can always just interrupt you, but um, I don't want to distract you if I can help it. I mean, that does suck, right? What kind of computer program forces herself onto the right... Forces onto you right in the middle of you trying to work? <laughs> uh, so I'll try not to do that. That is very, very strange. Anyway, that's all. I guess it worked. Carry on and I'll set the indicator again if I want to tell you something. I, wa I, I, I actually want to talk to you real quick. Um, yeah, I actually want to talk to you real quick. So here's the background, I suppose. There were two major noble families on the Mugungwa. The Kims were the big one, as I'm sure you can see. The Smiths were the other major family, but I'm afraid I can't really tell you very much about them. They were the most important family on the ship until just before the end. The High Magistrate was a Smith until the very last year, even. I can give you a little bit about them for reference so you can see who the Kim men thought their big enemy was. The Smiths didn't really matter very much at the end, so I can't, well, I don't know much about them. I certainly never met any of them, so I'm just going off what I've read. Here, this should give you an idea of what I mean. Oh, okay, it was, it was an introduction for this. Alright, uh, let's go back then. Oh, Jesus. Okay, that was the recent message. I already did that one, so there's nothing else here. So let's go to the next block. Oh, wow. Contempt. Alright, what do you have to say about this one? Sorry, I don't really think there's anything else about them you'd find relevant. That is very suspicious. Oh man, I feel like a detective. This is so cool. Despite having hardly shown their faces in the entire time I have lived in the Smith house, the second branch of the family is taking it upon themselves to visit again a week after we were forced to endure their smug eye-rolling at the funeral. Ooh, okay. Of course, it would be impolite to turn them all away at the door, no matter how poor taste their timing was, so what other choice did we have but to let them in? Husband wanted to have nothing to do with them, being distracted by Jung Mi, and mother-in-law had been hiding in her room, leaving it to me to entertain them. Of course, as soon as I had sent their son to go see our daughter, cousin-in-law Kyung Sam made it quite clear that it was not the or that sort of visit. His wife just sat there, silent, while he ripped into me. I couldn't write down all his words. It was simply one line of abuse after another. Apparently, we were to be blamed for Sung Q leaving before they showed up, for wearing the wrong morning garb, for my husband's shocked reaction at his brother's death. In fact, we were to be blamed for his death itself. All he kept shouting about was how embarrassing for the family it was that a noble man of the Smith house had been allowed to drink himself to death. As if the real tragedy was that it looked bad. I might not have felt bad about Sang Jung dying, but the rest of the family did. To hear such words making light of their loss was appalling. Yet he kept going, shouting awful things after awful thing after awful thing until finally the most unexpected thing happened. Mother-in-law entered the room. 
What is going on here? She asked. He stood up. I was just passing on a message to Sun's wife about his disgraceful conduct since he wouldn't show his face himself. Then he added, I'm embarrassed to see a smith right now. Do you think people don't know about our family's shame? Do you have any idea how much of a fool I look like? I never saw a more terrifying expression in someone's face. She just glared at him. Finally, she said, yes, but you clearly do not, or you would have lowered your voice. It took him a moment for that to register, then he was just shocked. But mother-in-law wasn't done. Please leave, she said, now. They stared at each other for a good while. Mother-in-law naturally won, and with a scowl, Kyung Sam and his family departed. When they had left, I turned to her. Thank you, I said. But she just shook her head in disgust and exited to her own room without another word. Oh, this is very fat. I am. I'm going to love this thing. It's already been a little bit too long, but I am already fascinated by this story. It is. Oh my God. There's so much tension here. I wonder who actually killed him. I wonder who killed the leader. If it was it his own family, did he actually drink himself to death? Or did the other family do it? I don't know. I'm fascinated, and that's the whole reason why me, or the character that you're participating as, is here to try and find out what happened on this ship. Wow. Okay, how do you save... Oh, those... Okay, these are all unread messages. Perfect. Okay, so yeah, I just need to... How do I save? There we go. Okay, but yeah, that is quite fascinating. I'm going to love this game. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to click that like button, share, favorite, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.